Hello, I'm Steve. I first discovered my faith at the age of 13. I came from a family who never went to church. Over the years, my church life has given me the opportunity to get involved in various things. Now I am retired, probably what I'm most involved with is YouTube. I believe that the most important thing in any relationship is talking. And it's the same in our relationship with God. That's what fellowship in a church situation or online is all about. So let's take our second step on our Lent journey. The reading is from Matthew. The world is full of so-called prayer warriors who are prayer ignorant. They're full of formulas and programs and advice, peddling techniques for getting what you want from God. Don't fall for that nonsense. This is your father you are dealing with and he knows better than you what you need. With a God like this loving you, you can pray very simply. Like this, our Father in heaven, reveal who you are, set the world right, do what's best, as above, so below. Keep us alive with three square meals, keep us forgiven with you and forgiven others, keep us safe from ourselves and the devil, you're in charge, you can do anything you want. You're ablaze in beauty. Yes, yes, yes. In prayer, there is a connection between what God does and what you do. You can't get, bet you can't get forgiveness from God, for instance, without also forgiving others. If you refuse to do your part, you cut yourself off from God's part. Loving Father, help us to keep talking to you and listening. Thank you for knowing what's in our hearts, even when we find words difficult. You love us unceasingly. You care for us in every moment of our life. Help us to have some understanding of forgiveness and use that understanding to forgive others and ourselves. We ask this as your children. Amen.